Here's a space riddle. How do you see something that lets no light out? You don't. That's the paradox of black holes. Some of the most powerful objects in the universe are, by design, invisible. Quick crash course. Gravity is the curve that mass puts into space and time. A black hole cranks that curve so hard the escape speed at a certain boundary. The event horizon goes faster than light. And since nothing beats light, not even light can get away. No photons leave, so no image reaches your eyes, your camera, or your telescope. Darkness by definition. So how do astronomers find them? Clues. First, stellar motion. If I see a star whipping around a point where nothing's shining, I can calculate the mass tugging on it. In our own galaxy, stars near Sagittarius A swing like race cars around a tiny invisible heavyweight. Boom, black hole. Second, gravitational lensing. Gravity bends space space, bends light. When a black hole drifts in front of background stars or galaxies, it warps their light into arcs or rings. I can't see the hole, but I can see the universe distorted around it like glass warped by heat. Third, x-rays from the dinner plate. Matter spiraling in forms an accretion disk that heats up to insane temperatures right before the fall. That hot gas screams in x-rays. We detect those high energy signals and map the crime scene, edge of the event horizon. And that famous photo of a black hole? It's not the hole, it's the shadow. The Event Horizon Telescope stitched radio waves from hot plasma around the hole to reveal the dark silhouette where light disappears. So yeah, black holes are invisible. Not because they're weak, but because they're too strong. They erase their own signal. We only catch their outline in the way they move stars, bend light, and light up the last gasp of matter falling in. No light out. Yet somehow, they shine everywhere in the evidence they leave behind.